The letter states clearly that it is a case where we have an old stock of furniture, we've been doing repairs, we've been using all what we have as auditorium furniture in the classroom, they haven't been standing up, they've fallen apart. In, in our forward planning for the new school year, we thought that, okay, that we ask our parents. The ministry is, 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 the, is the boss. You understand? If we can't go forward with it, it's just an initiative. As, it, as, as we said, it's a new furniture initiative we would like to adopt. People are taking this thing and twisting it all wrong. The school is not saying, look, you have to pay or else your boy wouldn't be allowed to get an education. I mean, that's so ridiculous. It's really ridiculous. This really is really a ministry responsibility, you know. But we just took it on our own. You understand? Trying to, uh, as a school, you know, as being responsible management, see what we could do on our own. We have, this is not something new. Old boys, parents, and whoever, and, and, and schools have fairs and have this and have that, and raising funds to do what? Not to provide whatever for school? Yeah, so, but we, we just happen to ask our parents, but people feel that it's so out of the ordinary, and people are having so much more to care than this and that to raise funds uh, for medical, this, for that, and what. Why? Maybe they could have said that is the responsibility of the hospital, you understand? To make sure that the care is there. So they, do, they don't have to do that. I mean, we just, as a school, among several other things that we've been doing as a school and other schools do, you try to get the best for your children.